today in this video i'm going to show you how you can create a database in mongodb atlas and how you can connect the database to the mongodb compass if you are ready let's get started so first you open a new tab on your browser then search for mongodb atlas click the first link and then click the try free button so here you have two options you can fill this form and then you can create the new account and you can go for the sign up with google option i'll go for the sign up with google option so once the account is created it will ask uh, for this uh, private you have to accept this uh, privacy policy and terms and service and hit submit so uh, your account is uh, getting deployed to the cloud database so now we'll ask some question so what is the primary goal so select your primary goal and then uh, how long uh, have you been developing software with mongodb select the time duration i'll be selecting 1 to 6 months you can select more and what is the programming languages uh, you are using i'll select javascript and node you can select any of them and the project uh, what kind of you know data you are going to store here so select your option and then uh, what kind of service you are going to build so whether it's search engine or microservice i'll go for the microservice and click the finish button so now it will ask uh, to select the option whether you want to go for the free one m0 or m10 it has a 10 gb of storage 2 gb of ram then this uh, cpu then you have the option for serverless i'll go for the free one and give any cluster name the cluster refers to a group of uh, mongodb database server that works together to store your data so give any name I'm giving cluster dash one if you want to store any environment variable or not so this is completely optional you can skip for now and click the create deployment option this is the user you will be using to access this uh, database keep any name root and password one two three four five you can use your own data and then choose a connection method okay so i forgot to create a user data uh, so user is created now you can go for this option choose a connection method these are the options available so since i'm going to connect this database with compass so i'll be going for the second option so it gives two option if you don't have uh, this mongodb com compass installed in your pc uh, you can select this or if you already have this you can go for this if you want to install simply click this and it will download it and then i already have this option so this is how it looks so simply you have to copy this uh, url and uh, paste it here or you can click the new connection or you can paste it here so this is the username and this is the password if the password is not showing you have to manually put it and then hit the connect up button this uh, database is successfully connected you can see these are the database available and then click the review and steps and click you can create your own database um, test blog and give a collection name posts 
and create so your new database is created you can check you can hit you can refresh it and you now you see the test blog is here thanks for watching this video if you like it please uh, hit the like button and if you new to this channel please uh, do subscribe this channel for the videos like this thank you so much for watching see you in the next video